Hello everybody and welcome to Gadget X-Ray. Today we're unboxing the new Nexus player. So the box is simple and get too little information. There is a screen picture and there is some French text. Okay, so let's unpack this beast and see what's inside of it. It's tracking 1.8 quad-core Intel Atom processor, so it should be fast and one gig of RAM. It's uh, made by Asus. Okay, so let's see the box. It's got a P for player. Let's cut the tape on the side and get rid of uh, this top part. And here we go. The new Nexus player, it's circular. It looks like a cylinder and it's a weird shape. Anyway, we have a quick start guide. But we don't need it, I will be showing you how to set it up and cardboard. And here is the new controller. I like it, it's sleek and light. And we have something hinder, hidden. Uh, it looks like a charger and some batteries. I like this charger. And finally, we have a safety and warranty booklet. All right, and now we need to peel the protection off. As well, there is some on the side. It's look like here we have Nexus branding and the uh, finish is matte. I like that. And the side is glossy. On the back we have Asus branding. LED lights. And as well there's more uh, protection tape. It's look like we have an HDMI port and micro and then power. This is a button. This is how I think you power it on and we will see it. And the controller uh, is very similar to the Fire TV controller. It's a little bit smaller and more easier to hold. And I like the finish. There is glossy finish as well on the buttons. You can put your batteries in there. Okay, there is an Asus branding on the back. So we have a pause and play button. Home. Back. Okay, and directional buttons as well a microphone. And there is a microphone hole in there. And you can pause and see the information about the wall charger. It's look like a 1.5 amps. And the end is not a USB, but it's fine. Okay, let's connect it with first with the HDMI. And let's connect the power. All right, it's look like it's on. Let's switch back to the TV and choose the right HDMI input. look like it's loading all right it's look like it's looking for the remotes we need to press on back and home make sure your battery is in the right position because if it's not, it wouldn't recognize the device. And hold back and home button. Nice, it's connecting now. And syncing. I 
I will choose English. Okay, I'm setting up my Wi-Fi. It's look like it's connecting. And it's uploading Android to 5.0. This process might take five minutes or so. Okay, now it's installing the update. Okay, so it looks like it's starting. Now we need to set up our account. It's asking to use either a password or use a phone. I'm just going to use the phone and just log into this address and enter the password they give you. All right, I'm connected now. All right, continue. Yes. And finish. It's look like we're set. If you found this video helpful and you're interested in more like these and tips and tricks, please subscribe. I will be making new videos and uploading them every other day. And here is uh, something like an Easter egg that they have in Android 5. It's look like a game. Take care and see you in the next one.